folks are sick of the cold rain that we've had over the past day or so, but hey, it could be a lot worse. We could be in the Delta where they're having an ice storm right now. Some of these purple and pink shades on radar you're seeing. This is freezing rain falling across much of the Greenville area up through the Delta up into Memphis and parts of West Tennessee. Luckily, we have not seen that around here in the Golden Triangle. Just plain rain for us as temperatures have stayed just above freezing for the past couple of days. 34 now in Tupelo and Starkville, but over in the Delta, 32 in Greenville, 31 in Memphis. That is why they are having the freezing rain problems out that way and the cutoff between the freezing rain issues and just the warm plain rain I shouldn't say warm I should say cold because we're just above freezing is really close to us we have ice storm warnings as close to Starkville here as Webster County Mississippi this is just one county away from us we're just in a flash flood watch here in Starkville because of all the rain we've had and we're going to continue to stay under that as we go throughout the afternoon and some of the evening hours as well also we're going to be seeing more of that rain Rain flow into the area as we go throughout your evening. Tuesday at 930, some heavier rain up toward northeast Mississippi and just some of that plain rain down here in Starkville with temperatures in the middle 30s. Those will be falling, though, as we go through the overnight hours, possibly to around freezing or so. But by the time we get into tomorrow morning, the rain will be on the decrease. We'll still have some rain for your Wednesday morning and throughout the afternoon as well. But temperatures will luckily be on the increase into the middle 30s, possibly even upper 30s to 40 degrees once we go throughout the afternoon on Wednesday and we'll be shifting that rain well into Alabama probably by about Wednesday night. So that's some good news getting this rain out of here as we go throughout the next day or so. But unfortunately, we still have to contend with it tonight. 32 degrees right at freezing for our low here in Starkville. We're going to see a very small chance for some freezing rain around here, especially if we do hit that 32 degree reading around here. But mostly just a rain event for us with those northwest winds at 5 to 10 miles per hour. As we get into tomorrow, temperatures will be on the upswing, luckily, so mostly a rain event for us again there. But as we go throughout the morning hours, as temperatures are still cool, we could see a small bit of freezing rain. Again, not too big of an issue for here in Starkville. And winds will be out of the northwest at 10 miles per hour. But as this system exits the region, there are some question marks. We are looking at the potential for some possible snow as we go throughout your Thursday morning. This isn't real well defined at this point. We are fine-tuning the forecast on this as an upper level low moves through the area. But luckily, temperatures will be on the increase as we go throughout your Thursday into the 40s. And look at that. By the weekend, just in time for it, lots of sunshine. Temperatures back into the middle 50s. Winter takes a breather as we get some more nice, almost spring-like weather in here as we go throughout your upcoming weekend. With your forecast, I'm meteorologist Ryan Ho.